say that if you read for one hour per day in your chosen field, that will make you an international expert in seven years. Now, I'm not sure this assertion is absolutely true, but it points to the importance of reading, which is why we are here. There's so much we read on our own in the comforts of our beds, bathrooms, plane. We read stuck in traffic jam. You know, we read, you know, during smoking breaks or even by the beach, purported to, I mean, anywhere. Now, let's share these reading experiences here on Uganda Reading with Brazia, a show for you readers. This is the premiere episode on which you are welcome to suggest books to read and ideas of encouraging more and more people to read. Plus, how best you can be motivated to read. It's a weekly show that kicks off with monthly reading challenges. You are part and parcel of what I hope and trust will be an interesting reading community. Now how about we pick our next challenge? It could be about anything. Love, fiction, science, politics, anything. Go to the comments section below and leave what you think we should be reading next. Or to at Uganda Reading on Twitter, Facebook or Instagram for those of you who say it better with pictures. We shall be looking out for what you have to say. The next reading task might be your favorite. Imagine that. Remember to use the hashtag Uganda Reading. Don't be shy about books. We all have stages as readers. We discover, fall in love, replace human interaction, get frustrated or go to hoarding and then later pass on the books. That's okay because this entire cycle is important for this show. Still on social media, if there's anything you're reading, obsessing with or would like brought forward from 2018 to 2019, feel free to let people know. Be sure your shout out will be read out here and conveyed to the readers that you are sending them to. Fridays, 4 p.m. is the clock to check out for new episodes. Now, Ugandan writers have been producing fantastic literature lately and truth be told, I'm kind of leaning towards you know, local authors and their works but that's a conversation for next week. For me and the entire community here, we are asking what do you know about Kintu? See you soon!